Hi there, Jill here from Holston Valley Farm. Um, being in South Gippsland, one of the things we have to contend with is a lot of water, as you can imagine. Um, probably get over a thousand mils of rain every year. And um, one of our major jobs has been putting in lots of culverts, pretty much everywhere uh, along lots of tracks. And then of course, putting in culverts has some benefits, but also there's some other issues that we've had to contend with. So this is what, um, when we contend with these issues. So we put in a culvert, here's one just under a, a track that we've put in. We've done these fences. This is one of our COVID projects, putting in these fences either side to create this laneway. So there's a, uh, for want of a better word, a dam there. Um, a cover coming through but the problem is a lot of the water comes gushing through whenever that dam over there gets full a lot of the water comes gush gushing through and then it erodes the exit so um, I've been putting rocks at the exits of a lot of the culverts and it's just made such a difference to the erosion and to the soil degradation so doing that in as many different spots as we possibly can. A lot of water does come through because this is actually also an overflow for some of the tanks that you see up there, some of the overflow. So there's quite a lot of water that sometimes comes down. Oh, look who's coming to say hello. Some of my friendly little ewe lambs. Yes, extra friendly. So just been trying to, I suppose, try and just manage that um, flow of water as one of the, um, little activities that we we do because again that, that goes right down through this little system and enters into that um that dam as well so all this gets quite wet as you can see with this sort of green part here and this is actually this is an area that's been grazed quite a lot recently um, with actually those ewes that you just saw so um yeah it gets kept quite wet quite wet through here over winter not too bad now it's still a little bit of um, sort of bare soil there but yeah so it makes a huge difference so putting in the culverts is one thing but then trying to manage that um, outflow is another so we've had some good success with using rocks and rubble to do that